That's it. That's it. Let's go. Uh, no, I don't even remember, bro. All right, y'all, your boy KP. We're here, Philadelphia, WrestleMania 40. As you see, heading into uh, WWE World. I got my man Najee in front of me, as you see. About to check out what's good and get to Rome. How you doing, bro? Talking to me? You're not talking to me. I'm talking to you right now. How you doing? I'm recording right now. <laughs> Just getting the optics outside. That's Philly right there. Uh huh. Here we are, WWE World. Welcome to WrestleMania! A brand new indoor attendance record. 101,763. Your two night total over 161,000.
is the final boss. Which means he comes in whenever he wants, mail, is does it? whatever he wants, does he? says whatever he wants, and then if you're shaking your head, you don't agree. <laughs> no. Where? Wait, you, is it? Is it What's that? You didn't win the Royal Rumble, Cody. Did. Kids, but man, I tell you, I'll be proud of her. I'd be proud of her. What you just say? I'd be scared, bro. <laughs> There's some unhinged people out here. Yo. Uh, okay. I should have been around if I really. That Versace shirt he has on, probably like 50000 Bruh. Roman's bitch? Oh, oh no, hold it. Oh, I'm missing it. Bro. Yeah. Yeah. Are you done? <laughs> Can't take that. Okay. Finish. Bottom line is, at the end of the day, you're a Cody Rhodes fan. I can tell you this, after Saturday night, The Rock will apologize in advance. I'll just say that to you. But enjoy WrestleMania, and one day when you get older, you'll understand. A man's gotta do what a, what a man's, man's gotta, gotta do. do. Where, Mel, where are you seeing that? Question. Because I gotta go watch more YouTube with Jalen Hurts. Who's got a question? Who's got a question? You got a question? Yes. Right there. The, the, you know what? <laughs> Why do you, he wants to know why do you think he got tickets for WrestleMania? Why I got tickets for WrestleMania? Alright, John Baby. Why do you why do you think I got Why do I think he got tickets for WrestleMania? Oh, this feels like you're gonna lure me into something. Why did <laughs> why do I think you got tickets for WrestleMania? Let's see. Why did you get why did you get tickets for WrestleMania? Got it. Uh, <laughs> I see you have a rock shirt on. Got it. I appreciate that. Let me take a picture. You want to take a picture? <laughs> God damn. You just... What does that sound like? That's a young man who just lost his mind right there. He said, you're literally my idol. You hear that? You hear this kid? <laughs> Can I get your brother in the picture? Listen. <laughs> the glasses? What's his name? Junior, come on, Junior. Let's go. Hey, that's, that's, that's a good lookout right, right there, too. <laughs> that's best friend forever right there. You hooked me up, bro? Yeah. There you go. Alright, you guys have fun at WrestleMania, okay? He not. Remember, he, he don't want to be there. Man's though. gotta do what a man's gotta do. What's up, man? What's up, dude? How you doing? 
Good to see you. Hey, hold on. Let me get a picture with you real quick. I knew you would be here. How's everything? Pretty good. So, Enjoying all the stuff? Yeah, I'm just hanging out for today. And then I got a, I got the Annapolis Comic Con on Saturday. So. Oh, so you're going back? Yeah, so well, I live in Minnesota now, so I've been yeah. trying to come out like a day or two early. And gotcha. Get this up and then tomorrow. I'm doing press stuff today and tomorrow. And then I'm driving back. That was awesome though. Yeah, yeah. I showed up right before you got here, so I didn't have to wait around all day. But. Sweet. Good to see you, brother. You too, dude. Awesome. Yeah. What have you, you been up to lately? What have you been working on? I do, I've been covering a lot of entertainment because I have my own outlets, awesome. you know. Uh, I'm, all right, y'all, WWE World. As you saw, we just got done checking out The Rock, talking to the fans. I'm now walking around a little bit. I'm gonna get my uh, press badge. And yeah, and also just see what's good. Dope memorabilia area. Let's go get this bag, y'all. All right, CM Punk's gear. Super sore. Gonna buy some gear later.
Got my merch, y'all. We a Ripley joint program. Let's go back to the stage, see what's going on. Riders, y'all.
It's big. No pressure. No pressure. They match up. I don't want to play you. Here, wiggle. Just be like a whole dance routine. Yeah. 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 You're on the wrong side of town, bro. Oh, yeah. You want to be Where's the rap, dude? Where's the rap? Come on, man. Oh, they go right for you. It was the jam thing. Wow. Yeah, I want that to work. I'm saying. history and doesn't exist, mm -hmm. I feel like that has something to do with Kofi more than it does to do with me. What's up, what's up, y'all? Boy, Creepy Nerds rule the world. Friday morning, right outside WWE World here in Philly. Uh, getting ready to start the press day uh, today uh, to talk to some cats. Uh, you probably saw on this vlog earlier uh, some of day one stuff uh, coming in at WWE World. Uh, we went to Wally Mania, uh, kind of just kind of did the lay of the land yesterday. Today's our interview junkies and stuff. Um, but yeah, stay tuned. Hopefully we'll get some coverage on that. Um, but yeah, that's, there you go, man. Tired, man. Been a long day. Had like four hours of sleep. Um, a long night. So uh, yeah, man, you see Philly showing out. Uh, there's like banners all over the place. I'm here over in like Reading Market. Uh, but yeah, WWE World. And uh, getting ready to get on this junkie, y'all. Huh? here for the press day, media day, WrestleMania 40. Nah, this I was just trying to bad. What's good? For sure. Check, check. Check, check.
What time you get up? What's up? Check, check. I'm already in. Already, I'm already in. Hello, hey, ladies. Cool, yeah. Pleasure to meet y'all. Nice Pleasure to meet you, yo. All right, I'm already good. This one right here. Yes. Cool. What's going on, world? It's your boy QUP. Nerds rule the world here at WrestleMania 40 with some amazing wrestlers, y'all. I gotta just tell y'all, women's wrestling got me back into wrestling oh, wow. because y'all are amazing. I can share it with my daughter, and I'm so excited for both y'all's matches. So it's a pleasure to chat with y'all, Dakota Kai, y'all. Uh, <laughs> EO Sky, Genius of the Sky. Pleasure to chat with y'all. Um, I have to ask y'all, well, damage control. I love the storyline. Y'all are killing it. Can't wait to see what you're going to do this weekend. Um, what are you excited for going against, uh, you know, you, you're, you're with your team, Asuka uh, and uh, Kyrie. I'm losing it right now. And you're going against Jay, Bianca, and Naomi, which we've never seen the three of them together before. How do you feel about that? Um, that team's obviously got a lot of star power and a lot of, you know, like it's Bianca, Jade and Naomi. You can't look past what they've done and Jade's coming in with a lot of star power. Bianca have known for a long time. Naomi has done so much. So that is a very solid team. At the same time, I'm with Oscar and Kyrie, who in their own right have done so much even before being in WWE. You know what I mean? Like they are insanely talented. So being a part of that team, I think we're pretty confident. Yeah. Y'all yeah, been doing it for a minute. Yeah, exactly. And they fresh. Yeah. They ain't ready yet. <laughs> Don't remind me. <laughs> Time is going. <laughs> you're amazing. I'm sure you're going to kill it. EO, you go all out. I love your matches, homie. Um, you're going to go against Bailey now. And you, and you said I love the packages. She's she been playing you. So now it's time to show and prove. What's up? <laughs> How do you feel about going against well, Bailey? Oh, well, going against. Yeah. Well, I have to win from her because she was the leader of damage control. Yeah. But I want to be more individual. Mm -hmm. I want to be more stronger. So mm -hmm. I have to beat baby up. Yeah. <laughs> and I can't wait. I love it. EO2, I'm curious of your nerdiness. What, if you were to give like a TED Talk on something nerdy, what would it be about? My TED Talk would probably be on The Last of Us. It's my favorite video game of all time. And I love that. I love the show. They did it justice. Like I could talk for hours and hours about that show. It's amazing in terms of how humanity is and would be in that world. It's, yeah, I love that game. I love it. And how about EO? About Anything like, you know, nerdy that you would want to talk about. I mean, like a you TED talk? Yeah, like yeah, TED talk, but yeah. like anything like um, maybe Pokemon. cats. Cat, there you go. Cats. I love cats. She loves her cat. Yeah, I'm a cat person. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. The cat lady, EO Sky, the genius of Sky. I love it. Dakota Kai, cannot wait to see what y'all are going to do this week. And it's a pleasure to chat with you both. Thank, thank you so much. You. And thank you for bringing women's wrestling. And I got my little girl all inspired. She wants to be a wrestler now. I love that. And that's the thing that matters most to us, that girls look up to wrestling and they can like want to be where we are. You know what I mean? And we're a positive influence on them. And I love that. That makes us happy. I love y'all. Y'all are amazing. Thank you. Everybody, EO Sky, Dakota Kai in the building. Your boy, KP Nerds World of the World. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Pleasure thank you. Take care, guys. Thank you.
Yeah, exactly. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, 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 I got you. <laughs> yep. All right. Hello, Roxy. Hi, how are you? Kuya. Pleasure to meet you. Nice to meet you. Awesome. We already going on there? What's going on, world? It's your boy Kuya P. Nerds rule the world here at WrestleMania weekend, talking NXT Stand and Deliver with my girl Roxy. So excited to meet you. Nice to meet you. How are you doing? I'm doing wonderful. And I first spotted you when you was doing your thing at uh, Ring of Honor. I was actually at your the very last Ring of Honor and seeing you perform. And like, when are we going to see her again? So when you came to NXT, I was so excited. My daughter and I are the biggest wrestling women's wrestling fans. And so uh, she wants to be a wrestler and she loves you. So shout out to Madison. Shout out to Madison. I hope all your dreams come true. Keep, keep going. It's going to happen. I can't wait to see what you're going to do. And thank you. Number one. <laughs> thank you. Um, Lyra Valkyrie. You're getting ready to tangle with her at NXT Stand and Deliver. Um, I'm so excited because you, you need your belt back, girl. You need it. I'm going to get it back. You know, Lyra Valkyrie, I'll give, I'll give it to her. She's, she's incredible in the ring. You know, she was able to beat Becky Lynch, the man. Um, so I'll give her that. She, she loves this. She wants this. But I wanted just a little bit more, so. I love it. I'm loving the promos. And I kind of like, you've always kind of been like that baby face. But now you get to do some heelish type stuff a little bit. Is, how is that as a performer to kind of like play with that a little bit more and like grow more as a wrestler? I think it's awesome. I think it's so fun. I think it definitely um, takes me out of my comfort zone, which I feel like you always need. Um, I, I've, I've been in that babyface role my whole career. So to now be able to step outside that box and like see how far I can cross the line, I think it's so fun. I'm, I'm having a lot of fun with it. Well, as a fan of yours, seeing that is so much fun for us because uh, we just know how amazing you are and how, how we can't wait to see you grow and build. Um, my channel's Nerds Rule the World because I think Nerds Rule the World. And I'm a card-carrying nerd. I'm a nerd too, so nerds definitely do rule the world. I love it. So what I want to ask to close this out is what, what if Roxy were to give, besides wrestling, we know wrestling is amazing with you, but what else are you nerdy about outside of wrestling? What could you give like a TED-style talk on? Hmm. You know, my favorite superhero movie of all time is Spider-Man. So I've watched all the Spider-Man movies um, a couple times. So, yeah, probably probably that. <laughs> Do you have a favorite Spider-Man? Uh, honestly, <laughs> honestly, I know that uh, probably Tom Holland. I know it's the last Spider-Man, but, like, he was my favorite. Yeah. What about yours? You know what? Tom Holland. I'd have to say Tom Holland, too. Yeah. He's good. Yeah. Like, he fit that role, like, completely perfect. Definitely. Yeah. Well, Roxy, it's a pleasure to meet you. Again, big fan of yours. And uh, go ahead, take that belt from Lyra because I need to see you rocking it. I will. Tomorrow, I'm becoming two time NXT Women's Champion. Watch on Peacock or get your tickets. Wells Fargo Center. Yes, sir. Roxy in the building going to take over that championship. Your boy, QEP, Nerds Rule the World. Roxy, it's a pleasure to meet you. Pleasure Thank you so much. You. No problem. Good chatting with you. Oh shit. Yo, shit. Watch out, sir. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, it is going down at the media day with AJ Styles and LA Knight. What the fucks? It's not a game, sir. Come on, guys. Save it for the ring. Come on, guys. Come on. AJ. AJ, come on. Come on. I'm stealing you guys' lunch. Yeah, are you? Yeah, show me. 
Let's go. These cats is wildin', sir. They got Tiffany Stratton on the other side. Oh my god. I think that's might be where I'm oh heading god. after this, bro. Oh it's gotta be tippy time. What's going on behind the scenes? I got my man Neeson up on the chair because Trick is mad tall. He's wilding right now. Getting some steals. Check, check, check. Recording, recording, recording. All right, we're rolling. Hi, Lyra. I'm Hi. Kuya. How's Pleasure to meet you. Kuya. Yes. All right, we're right there. What's going on, world? It's your boy, Kuya P. Nerds rule the world here at the media day for NXT Stand and Deliver. And joining me is one of my favorite wrestlers, y'all. I got Lyra Valkyria. Did I say that right? You did. You did. You got it. 
I, I try. I try. <laughs> it is a pleasure to sit with you and chat with you. I'm so excited for this weekend. But I have to say, I'm also a huge fan of Roxy. Like, it's difficult for me. Uh, you know, I'm so sick of people. Roxy was fantastic. She's great. But I'm sick of people not understanding or taking too long to realize that she's not the person she was anymore. She's just not. Uh, she had this, she lost it, and she let it break her. And people need to realize that she has no claim to this. She, she didn't climb the ladder last year at Stand and Deliver. She had an opportunity at Vengeance Day, which she lost. I didn't just beat her, I beat Lola Vice as well. And then she felt like she had to try and take me out before the match just to stand a chance at taking this from me. Very true, very valid. That's what also hurts, because I love you, Roxy, but come on now. What was it like winning it over the legend, the man, Becky Lynch? It was incredible. Honestly, it was, it was something I couldn't have even imagined happening. Um, it was honestly quite numbing because it was so huge, so uh, incredible. I felt like I couldn't even, even process it. <laughs> so it was amazing. I love it for you. That's so amazing. Um, recently, Rhea Ripley, they had Elimination Chamber in Perth. I know you're from overseas as well. What would it be like to do an event overseas? Oh, well, in we were, <laughs> yeah, in, in Dublin, Ireland, we were supposed to have um, uh, a big takeover there. Um, and then due to the pandemic, it never happened. So I would absolutely love uh, to be part of something like that. If, if it happened, it would be huge. Um, and I really hope it does somewhere down the line. We've got a lot more big events going that way. We've got Bash of Berlin, Clash of the Castle. Um, so I really hope one day Ireland gets that as well. I hope that for you. Are like all the family and friends like clamoring to like go to that and like see you like are Bash in Berlin when, when that happens? Are everybody planning their trips? I've got a lot of friends here at uh, coming to see Santa Deliver. So um, yeah, it'd be amazing. I love it. We're going to be cheering for you. I'm just going to be conflicted. Um, I have to ask you, uh, Nerds World World is my outlet. We're car carrying nerds. We're very proud to be nerds. I know you're a nerd, you're a wrestling, because you're a wrestler. You're a fan of wrestling, and you're nerdy about wrestling. But what are some other things that Lyra Valkyrie is nerdy about and that you could possibly give like a TED-style talk on that you're, you're really into? Uh, I'm obsessed with the Lord of the Rings. Lord of the Rings? Yeah, Tolkien. Uh, anything fantasy-related, I love. Is there a specific, like, uh, would you want to be a dwarf or, like, any character within that universe you'd love to be? I think I'd, I'd love to be an elf, but I think at heart I'd be a hobbit. So. <laughs> I love it. Lyra Valkyria, it is a pleasure to chat with you. I'm a huge uh, wrestling fan, of, especially women's wrestling. My daughter and I watch it religiously. She wants to be a wrestler. Oh. Yes. So shout out to you, Madison. Shout out to Madison. <laughs> Thank you so much. It's a pleasure to see you. Pleasure to meet you. Everybody, check out NXT Stand and Deliver with Lyra Valkyria against Roxy. It's going to be hard for me, but... Uh, may the best woman win. I'm, yeah. And, and there you go. There you see the bell right there. Thank, Thank you so much. Thank you. Appreciate you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Have a great rest of your weekend. You and good luck. <laughs> What's up, y'all? Your boy, Kui P. Nerds rule the world. Just got out of the media day uh, press junkets. Um, as you probably saw earlier on this vlog, if not, uh, I'll piece everything together. Um, Good times. Got to talk to a few cats, some long lines, wild, uh, learning, you know, how they do things here uh, for Media Day uh, with WWE. Um, I'm very sad that uh, I had an interview with Trick and the joint didn't record, y'all. So lost all that footage. Got a bunch of stills, but it ain't the interview, man. So damn. But uh, I'm going to make something out of it because I got content of Trick and Mello at uh, Wale Mania. So I'll put that together. But just sad that I didn't get that uh, interview uh, for y'all. Uh, well, I did the interview, but don't got the footage because shit didn't record. But anyway, your boy QP, I'm out. All right, y'all, what's up? Your boy QP here at uh, the in-between uh, guy uh, bridge from my hotel Marriott, Philadelphia downtown and the convention center. We just wrapped on the uh, junkets uh, for the media day uh, for NXT Stand and Deliver and WrestleMania. But I'm now heading over to, as you see in front of me, WWE World. So let's, let's go in, check it out. Got a couple things I want to pick up at the Superstore. Let's go. Here we are, WWE World. 
They're getting ready for the weekend, y'all. It's Friday as of this recording. So I'm sure Saturday and Sunday is going to be B-A-N-A-N-A-S. Pretty cool how this whole setup is. What's good? Uh, it's my tripod. I'm I'm press. Okay. Cool, cool. Yeah. Where? All right. Yeah, yeah. No way. Oh, this. Yeah, just check it. Tripod. All right, y'all. Just got through the security check. Let's go check it out.
Like that, but not for 225. Good lord.
going down at the media day with AJ Styles and LA Knight. What the fuck? Already going down. I, I'm excited, bro. Who you got? Who you got in that match, bro? Oh, I got uh, L A Knight. Yeah. You know what? As but much as L A Knight is though, yeah. I like the the rougher, grittier AJ Styles, bro. Hey, I don't, I don't, I don't. He's mind. coming out mean. He don't even do his thing when he yeah. comes out no more. He nah. just let's go, sir. Yeah. He don't have no music. So hey, 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 it's gonna be crazy. Hey. It's gonna be crazy. Shout out to my man. Let's see hashtag. Hashtag show. Hey, look at that. Uh, yeah, hashtag show. You see that? There you go. See that? Look at that. We can put it in the... There you go. Yeah, yeah, we're going to put it. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Please and I'm going to have my links in the description. Check out my boy, man. Cool cat. All right, y'all. Your boy, Cool P.